Hello, I just wanted to do a quick video to let you know what you're going to be working on today in class. Um, you are going to be actually writing the obituary of Moses. Hopefully you know what an obituary is. Um, an obituary is a writing of a person, usually it's listed in a newspaper after someone dies, highlighting their life's accomplishments, um, highlighting the different people that were important to them in their life. Um, and so as you write this obituary for Moses, you want to include as much background information as you can, um, include what you see as his life accomplishments, and also building on what we talked about last week, Friday, um, I would also like you to um, include how he demonstrated leadership during his lifetime. So sometimes um, it can be difficult to write things like this. So um, I did provide for you several examples of obituaries that you can look at. If you've never done this before, which probably none of you have, um, this, these examples will help you to um, see what an obituary looks like so that you have an idea when you go to write yours. So there are two different links here. Um, for you to use um, to help. You can do this as a Google Doc or a Word document and attach your work right here in um, Google Classroom. So if you want to include a picture of Moses, you can, because I don't know if you've ever looked at the obituary section of a newspaper, but sometimes they have an, a picture there. Um, include who some of his relatives were, that he was married, that he had a son. Um, all of those things, um, you can maybe include that Joshua was his successor. Any of that stuff um, would be important information that you could include in your obituary. So I hope you have fun with writing this. Um, tomorrow you will have an opportunity to review for the test and uh, the test will be on Wednesday and Thursday. So if you finish this early, you could be working on your review sheet um, already for the test. Um, and I will have a Quizlet on Haiku to help you with um, preparing for that test. Um, hope you have a good day and enjoy this assignment.